Good morning guys and welcome to Vlogtober day two and the insomnia has fully kicked in. We are at, well, we're having lunch right now. A late lunch, it's almost two o'clock, so she's definitely going down for an NAP soon. She had a really good morning. We had a play date, and it was really fun to see our friends, um, and the weather has been so nice. We went to this farm slash park called Kinder Farms, and it's usually $6, but with the military ID, you get it for free. So that was awesome to find out. Definitely plan on going there more often. Um, it has a park, animals, and all that stuff, so it's really cute. <laughs> but unfortunately we spent like the past hour at the store i tried to get new phones for the hubby and i and i did an online order but a store pickup and for some reason i got there and it was way more complicated than i would have liked because they didn't have one of the colors in stock and anyway we were there for an hour and i didn't love it so had to leave because it was basically her nep time and she didn't have lunch i didn't eat and when you have a pregnant lady and a toddler who haven't eaten, I mean, you guys know what happens. <laughs> so we're home about to eat and she's going to go down for an NAP since she had such a good morning. I'm thinking she won't fast for NAP time, right? Oh, yeah. Let me stop. Okay. Are you having a good day? Mm -hmm. Good. You go to the park? Outside. You went outside. Who did you see today? Dean. Dean, that's right. Hey. Haley was, where was she? Well, she was at home. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You'll see her again soon, okay? Hi. Hi. Hey. So I'm glad we can finally eat. Is that good? Mmm. <laughs> okay. Kevin's down for a nap. Um, I've calmed down. I ate lunch. I feel better. So, let's get ready for a 28-week pregnancy update. Okay, very informal today, guys. Lots going on, I feel like. In general, I feel huge. You guys will see my belly in just a moment, but just real quick, I'm officially in my third trimester. Technically, I'm heading into my 29 weeks tomorrow. I don't know if I told you guys that my due date is around December 18th. So, very close to Christmas, which is very exciting. Um, we are still nameless. <laughs> it's so hard finding a name but I don't know I feel like it will come to it will come to us eventually but right now we are still nameless oh, I'm definitely so tired these days but I have my gosh insomnia like no other I cannot fall asleep for the life of me um, and if I do fall asleep and if I wake up in the middle of the night it's so hard for me to fall back asleep and that's a struggle especially being a stay-at-home mom and caring for your toddler who's running around like a mad woman half the time. So I'm trucking through my coffee intake. I'm really trying to stick to one coffee a day. And if I want more coffee, I'll get decaf or just drink caffeine, uh, herbal tea. But yeah, not having as much coffee as I want is a struggle. So I try to savor my coffee in the morning, or at least I try to. So the bags are coming and I'm exhausted. But we're almost there. Um, I still can't believe, gosh, it's like 11 more weeks. It's insane. I'm totally not ready. At least we have our master closet though, so now I can start transferring all our storage um, out of the baby's room so I can start preparing the nursery. But yeah, insomnia is definitely a huge one. Um, bending over is no longer an easy feat. <laughs> I don't even know. It's just very uncomfortable. After a very short period of time, I can barely wash my face. So, <laughs> thankfully my skin has not been an issue. It's been the most glowing it's ever been, which I guess I have pregnancy to think, even though I was starting off with dry skin, but I'm thinking the products that I've been using. I am hungry a lot more often and I want to eat a lot more. <laughs> so, 
I my diet oh I want to say I'm trying to stick with healthy but I mean when the weekend rolls around I definitely want to eat my sweets and my desserts and I still eat dessert during the week 100% but oh I try to limit myself at the same time I don't deprive myself so I probably eat more junk than I should but it's okay oh I passed my glucose test yay if you saw one of my recent day in the life videos I did my well I took my glucose test and Kim came with me and that day I found out I passed. So that's a big thumbs up. It was so sweet. Cam was holding my hand when I was getting blood work done. Um, she wasn't really sure what was going on, but I asked her to hold my hand and she just like looked at me and held my hand. It was really, really cute. I'm hoping this, by her coming to my appointments, it will get her more comfortable at the doctor's office. She's usually fine anyway, but I just figured this would just further her comfort level, you know? And then yeah, the baby is kicking up a storm, which is awesome. Um, I'm feeling her kick a lot. I mean, here and there, she'll jab me like up in my ribs, which Cam used to do when I was pregnant with her. But yeah, I definitely feel her a lot, especially after I eat, um, when I'm laying down, and it's been really nice. So my appointments coming up are gonna be every two weeks moving forward, which is insane to think about. My next appointment is on Wednesday, which you guys will see in the upcoming vlogs. But yeah, I feel like I'm also swelling. I'm starting to swell, like, I don't know. I don't know, maybe when I see old videos of myself, I just feel less swollen, but I feel like I'm just starting to just swell up. Especially in places that I didn't think could swell up. <laughs> so that's been happening. Oh, and then obviously I'm still using the What to Expect app, which you guys know. Real quick, I will read you what it says. It says, I'm on week 28, day 16. Your baby is as big as a cauliflower. 16 inches, 2.5 pounds, 11 weeks and one day left. Uh, feeling a bit off balance, be careful not to slip. Slow and steady will, rin will win the race. Clearly they wrote this when they didn't have a two-year-old who's running around like crazy. Uh, yeah, she's keeping me very active. So, but anyway, I can show you my belly now. Okay, okay, so this is what, I'm wearing maternity jeans right now, but this is what my belly looks like. Oh. Nothing too crazy. This is 28 weeks, almost 29 weeks. <sighs> Definitely feeling huge, but looking good at the same time. <laughs> okay, you okay? Yeah. All the meltdowns today? Yeah. <laughs> Can you go sit down with Pig and Puppy? Go sit down. Sit down puppy. Yeah, thank you. Sit down, puppy. Down. You're okay, sit down. Okay. So not one of my most relaxing, cozy vlogs today, but that is mom life for you. I did get to make dinner. It's like a honey mustard chicken and it looks really good. So definitely really easy to make. The hubby just called, so he won't be home until a little later, which is fine. I'm just glad to have dinner ready. Rocky. <laughs> That's, you like Rocky. <laughs> That's right. Yum, yum. I usually like to think of meals for the week. I like to do, do my Sunday prep, Hi, but I just completely forgot. So today, I had no idea. Wow, that was really sweet. Love you. So I, yeah, so today I had no idea what to make. Um, when those days happen, I like to go to damndelicious.net or .com. I'll link the recipe down below, but I love her blog. I have her cookbook and she's usually my go-to when I need to think of something quick and easy and delicious. So I've never made this recipe, but I think it's gonna be delicious regardless, um, especially because the prep was like the best. It was so easy to make. Um, it took like half hour tops and yeah, I'm excited to try it. So. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm glad you like it. <laughs> All right, it's the end of the day. Um, the hubby's home, yay. He just had dinner. Did you enjoy dinner, babe? I did. Yay, so definitely highly recommend that recipe. Um, Kim really liked it too, so I'll link it down below. But Kim's finally down for bed. Uh, I'm exhausted. We got back from the Sprint store not too long ago because we ended up getting some new phones. Um, just got the iPhone 10, nothing crazy. We didn't want to go super new, but we definitely needed an upgrade from the success. So I need to sync our phones up, 
edit the vlog for tomorrow. So I'm gonna end the vlog here, but I hope you guys are enjoying these videos in Vlogtober. Thanks so much for watching. If you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.